Hello, my name is Bob Evans and I am going to show you how to measure your retaining wall and complete the form so we can price the materials for you. You can see on this slide the standard block, the coping stone and the end blocks. The end blocks have either a right hand face or a left hand face and are used at the ends of walls and corners. Internal corners do not require a corner block. The image shows you how the courses work for an internal corner. External corners require right hand and left hand blocks as you can see. This page shows you an example of how to measure your walls and how to complete the form. Study the sketch and how the form is completed by adding the dimensions and ticking the boxes. Only tick a corner block if the corner is external. Stop the video to study the method. This example is a stepped wall using the accurate method of measuring the wall. And this example is the quick method, but it is not as accurate. Completing the form. The form will be empty when you open it up. Enter the dimensions and tick the boxes to suit your wall. Next, select the colour of the blocks using the drop down box. Tick the box if you require coping stones. Then select the wall number for each coping stone. Next, complete the form to give us your contact details and the delivery address. Let us know if you have offloading facilities. If not, click the link below for options. And finally tell us of any other information you think we should know. And you can also add files. When you have completed the form, you should see this thank you message. If you have any questions, you can contact us using the website contact us page. Thanks.